Hello and welcome to another Two Minutes Tuesday technical training. Let's get started. Shown is a simple schematic of modern protein therapeutic production processes. Our focus today is optimizing cell culture. Many factors impact this and one of those is aeration. One of the most important functions within a bioreactor is the delivery of oxygen to cells through a process called aeration. This is normally done through sparging of air followed by mixing. This is the cell respiration reaction. For this reaction to occur, both glucose and oxygen need to be dissolved in the media so that they can be utilized by the cells. While glucose solubility is high, oxygen solubility is exceptionally low and therefore needs to be supplied continuously and controlled carefully during operation. Here we show the cell growth and protein production reaction. Oxygen and glucose are also necessary for biomass expansion and protein production. Since oxygen is the rate limiting reagent in terms of solubility, it is important to optimize the delivery of oxygen to the cells. The rate at which oxygen is transferred to the media is known as the oxygen transfer rate or OTR, which remains effectively constant for a set of bioreactor conditions. The rate at which the cells in the culture utilize an uptake oxygen is known as the oxygen uptake rate, or OUR. Initially, the OUR will be low, but will increase as the cell density increases. The OUR will increase until the OTR becomes the limiting factor. Thus, the rate at which oxygen is transferred to the media defines the theoretical maximum cell density. Bioprocess engineers define the rate of oxygen dissolution in terms of a parameter known as KLA, or volumetric mass transfer rate. KLA defines how much oxygen is available to cells for growth. This parameter is necessary for cell culture optimization and scale-up. OTR is determined by KLA and the dissolved oxygen, or DO, concentration in the media. KLA, in turn, can be manipulated through process and operational parameters. These will be discussed in part two. Thank you for listening. And for more information on this and other bioprocessing topics, including expert interviews, please go to our Two Minutes Tuesday archive. Have a great day.